Today, we're gonna to be checking out the all new Oracle LED off-road side mirrors for the 2017 to 2023 Ford Super Duty. These mirrors feature LED ditch lights integrated into the mirror caps rather than having cube lights attached to the side of the vehicle in some sort of bracket. These are designed to kick light out to the sides of the trail to provide peripheral visibility to the driver, unlike headlights and fog lights, which shine straight forward. The install is pretty straightforward, and we're gonna show you how to do that from start to finish now. Let's get into it. All right, so first we're gonna use a panel tool and we're gonna pop off this panel. Set that off to the side. All right, and we're gonna pull this plug out and unplug it, leave that off to the side. All right, next we're gonna grab our tin. We're gonna take these two 10 millimeter nuts off. All right, so now that we've removed the two 10 millimeter nuts here, we're gonna remove two additional tin millimeter bolts. So now we should be able to disengage the clip at the top and the mirror should come right off. All right, so we need to remove the top and bottom mirror glasses. So we're gonna take a flathead, and we're gonna get right behind the mirror and you'll see these black clips that we can use our flathead to disengage. Go ahead and unplug the heater element. Set the glass all to the side. Same for the top mirror. We're gonna find and disengage the black clips around the mirror assembly. Unplug the heater element. Now, if you have blind spot detection, you may have some additional wiring here for indicators. You just need to unplug those as well. All right, so now we're gonna take a deep seven millimeter socket and we're gonna undo these five screws. All right, so we need to separate the front face of the mirror from the back side. So we're gonna remove this courtesy light. We're gonna unplug it. We're also gonna remove the sensor. Unplug that as well. So now we need to disengage these clips. And at the same time, we're gonna pry the cap apart with our pry tool. And as you can see, this is gonna start coming right apart. And now we just need to keep moving down the mirror. Now we can pull the mirror cap aside. We're gonna unplug our spotlight. All right, so now that we have the front cap off, you're gonna see that we exposed another clip that was hidden. So we're gonna go ahead and disengage that. And that's gonna allow us to pull the painted cap away. So now we're gonna take our Oracle mirror module, gonna slide this right into place. We're gonna make sure that all of our clips engage. All right, so before we put the mirror cap back on, we're gonna take care of the wiring. We're gonna wire the positive and negative wire of the LED mirror module to the factory spotlight wiring. We're gonna do that using T-taps. So we're gonna put a T-tap on the outside red wire. And then we're gonna put another T-tap on the pink wire on the other end. Now we're gonna strip the ends of the black and gray wire. We're gonna crimp on a red male spade connector to the end of both wires. So now with our spade connectors crimped on, we're gonna go ahead and we're gonna insert that gray wire into the T-tap for the red wire. And it's very important to make sure that this metal contact in the center gets inserted into the slot on the T-tap. Otherwise, it's not going to make a connection with the wire. And the black wire is going to go to the pink wire. All right. All right, so now we're gonna plug our spotlight back in. So we're gonna pass our courtesy light wiring back through, and we're also gonna pass our sensor wire back through. We're gonna set our cover back in place. Get this all snapped back in. Now we're gonna flip our mirror back over. We're gonna make sure all of our clips engage.
We're gonna reinstall our five seven millimeter screws. And we're gonna reattach our sensor. And our courtesy light. We're gonna plug back in and reattach our mirror glasses. And now we're ready to install the mirror back on the truck. All right, so we're gonna put the mirror back into place. We're gonna thread our 10 millimeter nuts back on. And we're gonna reinstall our 10 millimeter bolts. Plug the mirror connector back in. And now we're gonna put our plastic cover back on. And we are good to go. So now all that's left to do is repeat the same steps on the driver's side and you're finished.